Hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough 4-3. The disappearing platforms of Doom don't look back. It's a tutorial on these things. Basically, when you jump off one of these platforms, the number shown is reduced by one. If the number reaches zero, the platform vanishes. So you can test it right here. Wow. <laughs> We got some balloons! You can use them to fly to new heights! And that's pretty much it for those. <laughs> I'm just gonna take a look see around these sorts of parts for any particular collectibles before I go up. Because I just wanna kinda do it in layers if at all possible. Oh shoot! Well. <laughs> yeah, there's a bottomless pit bounce down there, by the way, for. Those worried about the bottomless pits, I suppose. But with the flutter jump, it's kind of a kind of a non-issue in a lot of cases, unless you're knocked into them. Like when you're not holding Baby Mario, like say, uh oh, uh oh, like in more Monkey Map. Did that thing just that other one despawn? That that wasn't even. I didn't even have a chance. <laughs> okay, that was just bogus. At least it's early on in the level. But yeah, in stuff like More Monkey Madness, the whole uh, getting knocked into the pit thing is far more of a factor than... Uh, oh yeah, I forgot to hit that. <laughs> Gives you coins! And I should probably go up there right away and uh, get that shy guy carrying the red coin ASAP before I go and look for stuff on the lower areas. Okay, so there's this, right? Great. <laughs> See, as soon as you spawn it, it's basically over. Like, if you, if you miss the chance, you can't get up there in time, because it's, because it's, it's automatically going to despawn, and then you're just going to end up being a sad Yoshi. <laughs> anyway, it's just optional coins here, I suppose, so... I just go, let's try and do this as smoothly as possible. Like, get up there, and try and... Huh? Okay, there. Oh, th did that other one just disappear then? Oh, you freaking... Because there's two up there, and... <clears throat> when you don't know how many Shy Guys there are, that can be quite an issue. So I know there's at least two here. Like, there's the one. Uh, like, did I... Like, do I know if I despawn that other Shy Guy? I don't know. Yet. And I also don't know if there's a third Shy Guy, that's another thing. Freaking... at least I know I despawned this one. <laughs> and I'm getting to know exactly where that pit is in, re in relation to the wall, thanks to me uh, having to redo it because the dumb Shy Guy despawning. I'm gonna ride a balloon from this side up to the top and then go to it from the other direction. And then let's see what Shy Guys decide to betray me then. Because now I can go back over this way, and okay, there's that one. Wait, is there only one here? Maybe the no, oh shoot, I just seen the other one. <laughs> what a pain. But yeah, I think the better option is to go all the way over to the right rather than go up to the top. This is total bogus, but at least it's only this beginning spot, I guess. It's not like a whole game's worth of it, aka Mega Man. <laughs> okay, so going up, and I'll use the magnifying glass to check over those other ones when I actually get a successful run on both these Shy Guys here. Uh, okay, so we're gonna go up here, and we're well, okay, so now then the other one goes to the other side, was it? Or is there only one ever here? Because it always looked like there was two here, didn't it? I thought, maybe, could be, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I just want to see something here. Uh, I don't know if I can actually get back up from when the, where the balloons are spawning. There we go. Hmm. I just don't really know if there's two shy guys there now or not. Like maybe what I seen was one just disappearing from somewhere else. Maybe. 
And I'm just kind of kind of questioning my judgment here as to how many shy guys there were. Uh, well, fly guys. Red coins, yada yada yada. Red coins, yada yada yada. Um, you know what? I'm probably going to regret this if it doesn't work out, but I'm gonna assume that there was only one there, because it always seems like I can only get one anyway, so... I'm just gonna see what the le rest of this level entails, because I've been kind of stuck at the beginning for ages. <laughs> oh, this is a helicopter section. Um, I don't remember if there's any red coins here, so what I'm gonna do is magnifying glass it up, and make sure, without a shadow of a doubt, there are no red coins. Oh, shoot. And this level is just messing with me in every sort of way imaginable. <laughs> uh, okay, okay, there's a couple of red coins there. Uh, so wait, what if I were to just go through this middle ring? <laughs> like, with... Like, would I respawn back up there, and then I could jump down to recollect any sort of red coins that might be causing me ire, or can I redo this helicopter thing indefinitely? I cannot. What if I went outside the pipe and then came back, and then see if that wing cloud reappears? And will it give me a... it does, okay. That's actually more manageable then than the fly guys. <laughs> Those fly guys are so stupid. Uh, okay, so... Did I... I didn't collect all the... Oh, I was gonna say, I didn't collect all the coins, did I? <laughs> it just seems completely bare. <laughs> well, I guess if you want to cancel all, you just go down here and hit that really quick. Okay. Alright, so I'll know if there's two shy guys, if by the end of it I only have one coin that I did not get in my inventory, and then I'll restart the level until I get both Shy Guys on camera, and then I'll just finish the level by collecting the rest 100% off camera. Uh, I'm gonna hit this like that so I don't jump on the platform twice, just in case I need it. Uh, otherwise I could've just hover jumped to get that. Uh, let's just... Oh shoot, 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 shoot! Okay, at least I got that one. I don't know if that would have despawned if I would have came, like, if I would have made the camera pan upwards from over there, and then I wouldn't have been able to get up to here in time to get the other shy guy. Uh, okay. Now. Oh, this is a, uh, turtle one-up section. Oh, I missed it! <laughs> so sad. So sad. Uh, but at least it's not, like, missing a... What was that? What was that? What was that? I seen that. I see mm, 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 freaking! I said I seen that, and I did see that. <sighs> the fly guys here are just horrible. <laughs> like, like even more horrible than they usually are. Okay, so I even got I got all the red coins from that um, flying section. Now it's just a matter of repeating this, I guess. Okay. Now I'm gonna go up and above this really quick here. As fast as I can. Oh, shoot. And it already... <laughs> this level is pretty horrendous. <laughs> but we can do this, in theory. Maybe. <laughs> With, with a lot of persistence and a lot of teeth grinding dust on the floor, we, it's possible to do this. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna try doing something a little bit different here. I'm going to try and shoot that Batui as far off camera as I possibly can, and uh, see if I can actually not spawn that shy guy. Let's see here. Uh, okay, let's try this. This might be a method to the map. No, it's still spawn. Why? Mm. <sighs> that is not a method to the madness. I guess I could use a Koopa to get up a. Whoops. Well, <laughs> my hover jump failed me, so 
I got below that lower platform and it was over. But yeah, uh, I think what I should be trying to do is get above that then. If I can't manipulate that shy guy to spawn when I want it to spawn, I should at the very least uh, race to the top uh, using some sort of method. <laughs> Maybe with the power of a Koopa, like say, uh, one of these over here. Like, what if I were to go ahead and use this to start a new heights, and go above everything, and then I go like that. That works, I guess. <laughs> but it's bogus that you need to know that. Uh, okay. And then this is just a bonus for 1-up, if you can pull it off. Gotta get all the Koopas timed together with each other so that the shells nick, nick each other. Okay. Pop. I wonder if I should refill on eggs using one of those patooies, but, well, hopefully we don't need to. This has got to be one of those sorts of runs where, oh, I was going to say, this has got to be one of those sorts of runs that you can redo as many times as you please, uh, because if you fail that, you gotta got to kind of go back up to the start, I mean, go back down to the start, excuse me, where that switch was. All right. Uh, what do we get? Can we get them all, I should say? <laughs> Okay, we're up 28, and that post always struck me as suspicious, like, it, that it would have a red coin or something, but it doesn't, if I recall correctly. Uh, so I'm not going to mess with that, because it's very, very tight, and I'm going to, hopefully, not anger the fly guy gods. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So far, so good, assuming that there is only one fly guy at the beginning there. Um, uh, oh shoot, this is a um, this is a different section that's gonna give you a, a different, like a tutorial on a different kind of balloon. Uh, but I just wanna take take on this lower section first here before I. Uh, <laughs> uh, well, maybe no, wait, no, 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 actually. I'm doing it wrong. You want to do the higher section first, where the secret area is, because when you when you fall from it, you can actually get get yourself to a uh, like back to where you were. So, you, so here we got this. You can blow it up faster by by ground pounding it. Step on this and get ready to collect coins. Oh boy, this is easy to miss stuff at, especially since they kind of oh shoot. Well, maybe this is just for bonuses anyway. I hope. I hope. Oh shoot, it's getting away from me. It's getting away from me. Oh, saved, I think. Unless I missed the red coin in with that bunch, but I hope not. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I don't think there were any red coins there. Um, let's just keep going on. Oh, that was the last! Is that it? Oh yeah, that was it. So there was only one fly guy at the start there. I was driving myself crazy for nothing. Um, now I do believe there's actually two exits to this level, but they both lead to the same place. Like that other one, I think would have led me to another uh, exit down on the lower path, if I recall correctly. But anyway, I'm not. I'm not going to mess it up this time. No way, Jose. <laughs> And I got a bonus. Alright. So that ending section was not nearly as bad as that potential uh, fly guy loss at the beginning section, plus after that Patui plant. But 100% is indeed doable on this level. <sighs> Alright, let's bet 99 Yoshis again and just see what we can get, because we're never going to see a game over anyway, unless I do it on purpose. <laughs> we got plus, plus, three, 102 up! <laughs> That's not a word you'll hear very often in the world of video games. <laughs> Alright, we're done here. Well, although I would kind of like to show you that other exits, because I, I do, I believe, do believe there is another exit to this level. Uh, but it, as I said, it doesn't lead to the same place. That it's just the whole thing about that balloon. That that if you don't take the balloon path, or you're not able to finish that balloon path because it's it's difficult. <laughs> 
it's just a thing of that they have an alternate exit for you to actually go to. So I'm going to show you that alternate path. I'm not going to collect anything along the way. Well, I mean, whatever I collect as I go, as I run back, I will... I'll do, but, you know, it's not going to be anything that's not going to go out of my way for collectibles. Since all I'm doing is just running back over to that other section. I wonder if I should get that midpoint at the helicopter area, but... Eh, I don't know. Oh, wait, hold on a second. I want to see here. Uh, oh, they do give you an opportunity for that. Okay. That is interesting. Okay. And, oh, yeah. Okay. This one's... This one's almost mandatory, because, yeah, you can't even bounce over it using the Koopa, because it's just too close to the lips of that piranha plant. Alright. Oh, shoot. You know what? You know what? I'm going to... <laughs> there we go. That saves a whole lot more time. And... We are off. <laughs> oh, shoot. I was gonna say, we are off. We are not off. We are not off. We're not even close to off. Uh, I need to... Oh, this one. Oh, shoot. Get out of my way. <laughs> okay. Now. Back to the uh, junction, I guess you could say. So, yeah, if you were to fall off the balloon, you'd basically end up back here, and then you wouldn't be able to get those red coins, if I recall correctly. And since that's a little bit dicey, it might take a couple of tries from that midpoint. Which is nice that they have that midpoint there. Um, unlike some other <laughs> some other aspects of some levels. But, uh, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, and we go through here. Oh, Boo Balloons! Yes, I believe they contain the uh, elusive exclamation point switches. Just to uh, allow you to get... <laughs> I'm not getting that, am I? Just to allow me to get those coinages. Uh, well, actually... Uh, eat, eat, ah! Because I learned that you just you eat that after I had that issue that other time, but alas, alas, it failed me. Uh, okay, so that does not give me any sort of switch. I was hoping that the crate would give me a switch, and I wouldn't have to deal with trying to get a switch from the uh, boo balloons. But alas, alas, that appears to be what I have to do to get this coin cornucopia here. Because I do believe it's just like that castle where there's boo balloons, then you shoot one and it pops. Well, not that one, I guess. <laughs> Which one has the switch then? That is the question. Or maybe this is maybe this has the switch. No, it has stars. There's another one-up uh, balloon over there that I see over there. It, it's called a mock-up, actually. Uh, but. Yeah, I just, I don't know, I just always called it a one-up balloon because for the many years I played this game, I had no idea what the name of the, the enemies and stuff in this game were for the most part. And, oh, shoot, I missed. And they're so wiggly, so jiggly. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. You are the worst. The worst. <laughs> Wait, can I go on here and fill up faster? No, I can't even do that. <laughs> Such a tease to be to have a shy guy pipe without there being a double shy guy interior of the pipe. You know, you can get eat two shy guys in a short amount of time. Okay, I'm back to six. Let's try this again. I'm not really caring for those sorts of coins. I just want to see here if I'm correct about there being a exclamation point switch uh, in one of these. Oh. Nope, guess not that one. Okay, let's try this one now. Is this one? Yeah, there we go. So of course it would be the absolute last one that I would try, because why not? <laughs> I wonder if it would be possible to get all those coins within the time limit. I think it would be. I just was kind of inefficient on my uh, attack pattern. <laughs> Alright, so now, I guess I'll refill a, a couple of them again, because why not? Just Maybe I'll just do two this time. Oh yeah, I got a one-up. Yeah, if you eat it, you'll get a one-up. I'm gonna use this to my advantage. That one I'm just gonna ignore. <laughs> and here's the alternate exits, which I don't have any flowers for, because I just ran through the level. Heck yeah! <laughs> so no bonus stage now. Woo!
So yeah, it's kind of interesting that this level has two exits, even though they both lead to just the next level, but hey, that's it's something different. Something a little, little special about it. And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when 4-4 begins. And it's a pretty tricky castle, too, so I think I'm going to take a break between parts. <laughs>